songs in this party, I can't even listen to it. Anytime that I run into somebody, it must be a victory lap. Hey, Shotty come sit on my lap. Hey, this ain't Tracy just snap. This is between us, it's not like a store. This isn't a plausible gap. Hey, I see some niggas attack. And don't end up making it back. I know that they had the crib going crazy down bad. What they had it didn't last. Damn, babe. Yeah. Where did these niggas be at when they said they doing a morning everyone and welcome back to a new video um so it's saturday today and i thought i could film my like morning routine um so obviously every saturday can be different um i don't know how long this video will be either but i just thought i watched one the other day and i thought Do you know what i really want to film one so yeah welcome back to a new video um thank you for clicking on this video um if you're new here my name's harriet um please like and subscribe if you enjoy this video so yeah i'm off to the gym now i can't actually record anything in the gym because i do a gym class so um but yeah i'm off to the gym now so i'll catch up with you after but yeah happy saturday and welcome to a new video everyone right everyone i'm back from the gym um i'd usually have a sh shower straight away and then i'm just all showered then but i am ravenous i am so hungry so i think i'm gonna make myself a smoothie because we don't have any like i don't have any food in really i don't have any food in because i'm gonna go do my food shop in a minute i'm gonna taste, I'm gonna taste. actually i'm sweating So yeah, I'm gonna go and do, I usually do my food shop on a Saturday morning. Um, so we have no food in, so I'm kind of just using what we've got in the house. So I've got a smoothie mix in the freezer. So I think I'm gonna make like a nice smoothie breakfast. I'm not a massive breakfast eater. That's why I don't have like bread or anything in the house, but this is just the exotic smoothie mix from Aldi. So I'm just gonna put, if I can get it in. I'm gonna put some of that in there. Probably like that much. And then I just actually popped into Home Bargains just to get a yogurt. But these Graham ones are so nice. This is the passion fruit, mango and papaya one. And it's got 25 grams of protein in. And obviously I've just done a workout. So I want to get my protein in. Let me try some first. Mm. The peach one's really nice as well. Um, so yeah, I want to get my protein in. So I'm just going to put all of that. You can't see from me. Let me put you down. Right, you can't see me now, but you can see what I'm doing. So I'm just going to put all of that in there. Like so. Wipe off. like so and then I'm just going to add some extra I'm just going to add some extra protein in and um, that's just a clear way one and then lid on Right, so here she is. She's leaked a little, but it is so thick. Mm. That's really good, that. She is thick, but I like it when it's like that. 
So yeah, I'm gonna, God, my straw looks so long for this glass. I wanna get some glass straws, I think, from B&M. Um, I'm so yeah, I'm gonna drink this. Well, I'm gonna have a shower and probably drink it while I'm getting ready um, because it'll take me forever because of so thick it is, but hmm. let's go and have a shower now and then we'll get ready. Right, I'm back, I'm showered. I put my dressing gown on. I've got my smoothie. It's starting to melt a bit now, so it's easy to... Easier to drink, so I'm just gonna do my makeup. Um, so I don't wear makeup in the week, usually to work or anything. So I quite like doing it on a weekend. Um, Excuse my little bow. I quite like doing that on a weekend. Um, I also try and get some pics for in Instagram, Insta Instagram on the weekend as well. So um, yeah, so it's quite nice to do it. So I'm gonna run through what makeup I use just from my everyday. Um, so skincare, I did do some this morning, but I'm gonna do it again. So I've been using this earth harbour biome brightening like drops thing i got it in my asa asos asos advent calendar so i've been using that when i remember so I'll just put a few drops on just gives my skin like a bit of a glow i really like this one i just need to reorder it the ordinary plant derived one that one really makes my skin glow um and then i'm gonna use this vitamin enriched primer the bobby brown dupe from primark um really like this i've been using it as my normal moisturizer now for quite a while um it just like it smells really nice it just yeah really been loving that one and i usually do brows i use my my brows do need doing i've got them booked in for not next week the week after the week i go to barcelona um so i just i've just got a morphe brush and just get some product and then i usually just brush them up I'm no makeup expert um, by any means, but this is just what works kind of well for me. Uh, Carmex, of course, on the lips. I don't think I've ever done like my full everyday makeup routine on um, YouTube before. I made a TikTok on it last week, but I haven't posted it yet um but yeah then i've really been loving this filter finish complexion boosting primer illuminator from collection it's what i i haven't used the charlotte tilbury one but that's why i imagine it being like um and this is the lightest shade fair i think yeah fair medium too so I just put that all over my skin. I can imagine this is gonna be really nice in the summer, just as like a base, you know, like when you're on holiday. Um, and then I only use beauty blenders for like foundations and stuff like that. Just works well for me. I would like to get into a brush, but the, it just leaves no marks. I also do have a few little friends. My skin was getting loads better and then it's just dropped off again. But I think it's like just that time of the year. Like with it being cold and your face dries out more. So yeah, put all that in and just look at the glow. Like it's just incredible. And then my everyday, um, I don't use foundation. This is a skin tint. Um, this is the Maybelline Kind and Free, and this is in the shade 160 Vanilla. This, I've re-bought it. I love it. 
it just gives your skin like such a nice glow and it's not cakey like it just i don't know i'm just obsessed with it i bought it because i used to love the fenty skin tint um and that was like i was in uni i think at this point and i couldn't afford to buy the um fenty one and i was like right let me just see what i can get that's similar so he picked up that one and yeah i haven't gone back since so yeah i just buff when i say buff put that in all over my skin like so and it just i just love it um concealer of course last imperfection collection one this is the hydrating one um and this is in the shade ooh, number six cashew so i just put it like problem areas and then i use the same shade on my eyes as well um like so and then just I do have a little spot here as well that's like you know one of them like blackhead spots it's so annoying and it just doesn't want to cover up so never mind just buffing all that in i've also like as i've grown up a bit i've realized that like you, know, you don't need to cover every blemish like you do want your skin especially like they say you want your skin to look like skin like we've all got imperfections in that so it's not a bad thing if like let me show you what this skin looks like do you know what i mean like it's not a bad thing to have blemishes in that so yeah that's kind of like my foundation base and then i use the refi cream bronzer in the shade sand and um, this is my favorite thing ever i had a new one for christmas that's why it looks very new but i just love it it just like it blends so well blend yeah it just blends so well so i just take a little like flat top brush and just like pat it in and then i just put that where i want it and it always looks a bit scary when you put it on because, like, you know what I mean. Put that around my forehead, put it on the end of my nose, and then I just put it in my eyelids as well. Instead of doing eyeshadow, maybe do that here. And then I just blend that in. And it just blends in so nice. So yeah, that's kind of bronzer. I don't powder bronze. Um, I used to use some like if I'm going out, I will. You know, like on a, a night out. I can't actually find it now. Where has it gone? Oh, I use the Mac. Give me some. Um, but day to day, I don't. Like, I won't powder bronze now. Um, same with blush. I don't powder blush either. So for blush, of course, Refi in the shade Malaya. Um, <clears throat> love this stuff. A little bit goes a long way. Let me open it. It just is the most beautiful shade. I never used to wear blush before I bought this. Um, yeah, a little bit goes a long way with this. So I'll just pat that into my cheeks. And then I just pat that in with my sponge and kind of go back and forth until I'm happy with it. And then powder. So I use the Laura Mercier powder. It's in the shade Translucent. It's just my favourite. Favourite powder ever. So I just use a little brush for this. Um, I really want to get the seen the the puffs like the powder puffs the trig well one um off tiktok i just keep forgetting to do it but this works fine so i just usually do my under eyes 
usually where I'm most oily, so for like forehead, nose, chin, and just around my under eyes. And then, then mascara, I oh, love this one. It's the Sky High one from Maybelline. Um, I'm just gonna put, my lashes aren't long at all, so I'm just gonna put some of that on. You probably can't even see a difference, but that's all done. And then lastly, lips. I need a new um, lip liner. The Morphe ones are my favorite. I've just somehow lost them all, so I need to get a new one of them. But lipstick, I've really been loving this combo. Um, MAC Velvet Teddy, I had it in my ASOS Advent Calendar. So I just... So yeah, just put that on. I just love it. Like, I just... Yeah, it's my, definitely my new favourite at the minute. And then I put a lip gloss over this, um, just to give it like, I just love a lip gloss. This is the e.l.f. lip plumping gloss, um, but my other faves are the Kylie one. This is in the shade High Gloss, oh no, Lost Angel 315. That's another one of my faves. And the Fenty one, the Fenty one that everyone loves. I just, it's not in my drawer, it's in my bag. Um, so... Just put get that on like so, and that is all my makeup done. Um, just gonna brush my hair. Um, I'm just gonna have it. I haven't straightened it or anything. I've just I just blow dried it with this brush last night. Um, so it's not like straight straight, but it will do it's also got a little bit of a kink in there isn't it so yeah i really try not put heat on my hair because it helps it it's really made a difference with it growing um so yeah that will be my hair for today so let's pick an outfit now and then yeah right let's pick an outfit um I'm not doing anything amazing today and I'm going to go and do my food shop after this. So I'll put that obviously in the morning routine. Um, and I think me and Joe are going to go... It sounds a bit silly but we wanted to try. Um, there's a Morrison's near us that has like the big food hall with loads of different places so I think we're going to do that. Um, so yeah, let's pick an outfit side. So I think I'm going to wear these Zara cargos. Um, really like these ones i also had so i had them for my birthday and i also had the green pair at the same time the green pair don't fit me it's really weird like they're the exact same style they're the exact like same thing same size but um they don't fit me so i've kept them because i am gonna fit into them but a bit random um and then i think i'm just gonna wear my favourite tops from Prime Watch, the long sleeve ones, a grey hoodie, and then I think I'm going to put my trench over it, try and like layer a bit, so I'm going to get changed down in two weeks. Right, so this is my outfit. I really like this. I feel like I'll be definitely, well, let me try and put you up here. I'm going to try and put you a bit higher. So you can see it all. But, right, that's a bit better. So yeah, trench is ASOS, but it's Bershka. Hoodie is weekday, cargo's Azara, and then I'm just gonna put my new balance on. Um, so yeah, that's today's outfit. I'm gonna go and do my food shop now, um, because I always do that on a Saturday morning. So I'm ready for the week, and then I'll come back, show you that. And then that'll be my morning routine. Yeah. Hello everyone, I'm back. We've done the food shop. Um, we've got two bags full. So, um, let me show you what we've picked up. So yeah, I do my food shop every Saturday morning.
it's done then. I've got fresh food for the week. Um, it's just like, yeah, schedule that I've done. So we went, I always shop at Aldi and then whatever we can't get from there, we either go Home Bargains or Asda or somewhere like that. So from, let me do Home Bargains first. So I've got some Skinny Wet Bars. Um, these ones are my favourite ones. And then these were new ones as well. Raspberry and white chocolate um, crunch. So give them a try. I just have them with my lunch as like a little sweet treat. Got some crisps for Joe. Um, picked up this protein flapjack to try. Um, I was meant to get Mexican rice from Aldi, but completely forgot. So I picked up chicken flavour and then this one, which sounded pretty well on the back. So you have them with my lunches with chicken salad. Maggie bag for tea this week. Um, some chicken tikka masala sauce for curry. Some noodles for Joe's lunch tomorrow. Kit Kat chunkies for Joe's lunch. And some new toothpaste. This is our favourite one. So that was all, I think, £12 from Home Margin. And then the rest of it's from Aldi. So I picked up four of these rice for teas this week. Um, some apples. Some green beans. Big bag of potatoes. So I've been making my own like chips in the air fryer. A bit healthier and um, obviously you can use a big bag of potatoes at last you forever. Um some salad from Camila. Camila from Ireland. Some more oh some lettuce for those salads. Some grapes and then this little stirring pasta. Um for bolognese, just use that for bolognese this week. And then we also got some more lettuce, uh, chicken gyros or gyros. Um, this serves too, and I usually just make some like air fry chips and add some salad. This is really nice. Um, got a whole chicken. This Chinese chicken. I always have this you would have seen it in my blogs loads of times so quick so easy to have some more grapes big pack of chicken a pack of mints for bolognese that's one of our teas this week some tomatoes naan bread and then some protein yogurts. I love these ones. They're the skier ones. Ooh, they're the skier ones. I just have them for breakfast. And that was everything. I got four of those. And that was £39, I think. So, not a bad week this week. So, I'm just going to put all that away now. And then, yeah. Right, everyone. So, that is my morning routine. Usually on a Saturday or a Sunday. I'll um, like have a clean around the apartment, clean the bathrooms, hoover around, but I'm actually going to do that tomorrow. But sometimes, yeah, that's like a, a normal thing to add in on um, either a Saturday or Sunday. But um, yeah, I'm going to do that tomorrow because I don't actually have anything planned for tomorrow. But yeah, I hope you've enjoyed the video. It's been quite nice to make because usually, obviously, I just put little bits of my morning into my weekly vlogs. So it's been nice to have like a video dedicated to my morning routine. Maybe I'll do an evening routine at some point. Um, I also don't know how long this video will be, um, but I'll put it up regardless. So yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if this is something you want me to film again or an evening routine or anything like that, just let me know. Um, or if there's any videos in particular you wanna see. But yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please like and subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video.